Hey guys, Will here with Into Mobile. Today we're taking another look at the Motorola Droid X. Uh, this guy right here is the Motorola Droid X from Verizon. If this thing will focus. Alright, so we have the Google branding, the Verizon branding, and of course, you know, this is the Droid X because it's got the 8 megapixel, uh, the super high HD resolution camera that uh, has a camcorder that can record video in HD, uh, 720p HD, in fact. Um, so, we've gone over this phone in pretty good detail every once in a while, but you'll notice this is a bit of a departure from our usual hands-ons. We've got the San Francisco skyline out, out yonder, just to show you guys. So, what, we, what I want to show you today is a, a couple features of the Droid X's camera. And we're going to do that real quick. We're going to unlock this guy. And I'm going to put him into camera mode by holding down the shutter button. Gives me a little vibration to let me know that it's in it's in the right mode, and um, you know I'm gonna we're gonna go to single shot mode real quick just so I can show you guys. I'm um, tapping the screen brings up the options. You have all these uh, different scheme scene um, scheme uh, scene effects: auto portrait, landscape, sport, night portrait, sunset, so on, macro, steady shot, and auto again. It just wraps back around if you keep on. Uh, keep on scrolling around there. Um, Everything is pretty self-explanatory there, right? Okay, well you also have effects, which are, you know, uh, of course, you know, black and white, negative, sepia, solarize, red tint, green tint, probably blue tint, there we go with the blue tint, or back to normal. Scene effects, and you also have, uh, you can also uh, mess with your um, ISO sensitivity and your exposures and stuff like that. But thing we're interested in today is actually going to be something called Panorama Assist. And what Panorama Assist does is it assists you, it helps you take panoramic portraits. And okay, so oh, we got a little bit of glare there, let me try to get the camera to refocus. Um, so basically what Panorama Assist does is it allows you to take really good panoramas. And it does that all automatically from the camera. So let me get this camera to focus real quick. There we go. So if I take this picture right here, notice in the bottom left hand corner I have this little box. I have these little boxes that tell me, well, if I move, I'm moving the camera along with the, uh, the video camera along with the Droid X. I'm going to try to keep it in plane along the same, basic, basically the same height that I was taking the other pictures at. And as I move it, notice that the box in the lower left moves as well. And that's going to basically detect when it's at the next frame and take the shot automatically. It'll give me a little beep and it'll take the picture real quick. And it takes six shots. And then, taking the last shot. Alright, so it's going to process that real quick. Still stitching captures. And there you go. And it creates the panorama. You know, it's you're going to have a little, uh, some curved lines here and there. Some, um, some, you know, some aberrations, basically some visual artifacts from the stitching process because it's not perfect and it's doing it automatically so you can't expect it to be perfect but still pretty good um, let me see if I can take a look at it let's go to the gallery app there it is so there's the panorama that I just took automatically stitched together by the Motorola Droid X.